Now you probably already know that in Reaper, we could scroll horizontally by using Alt on the PC or Option on the Mac, and just use the mouse wheel in our arrangement window. Hold on the modifiers and scroll right or left to scroll through our project. And we could also use the Shift key instead. Hold on Shift, and use a mouse wheel up and down to scroll right or left to scroll through our project horizontally. And to zoom horizontally in and out, we don't have to hold down any modifiers at all. Move the mouse wheel up to zoom in or down to zoom out. But we could also use a hand tool to do the same thing. If we go to our preferences, control P on the PC, command comma on the Mac, it opens up our preferences. We could scroll down under editing behavior and choose our mouse modifiers. And if we go to the context under range view, right drag, we can see right here, we could hand scroll with these modifiers. On PC, it's Shift Control Alt, and on Mac, it's Shift Command Option. Hold on those modifiers within the arrangement window and right drag. Our cursor changes to a hand tool, and we could scroll by dragging right or left through our project. And we could also do this with middle drag. Change the context to middle drag right here. And we could see by holding down the shift key, we could hand scroll the same way. Hold on the shift key while holding down middle drag. Again, our cursor changes to a hand tool and we could drag left or right to scroll through our project. Now the easiest way to do this without any modifiers is to go up here in a section known as the project marker region lane. Not down here, which is known as the ruler, but just above it. Notice by default, our cursor changes to a hand tool. And we can just grab it without using any modifiers to scroll through our project, right and left. And we can see this in the mouse modifiers right here on the project marker region lane. By default, it's going to hand scroll just like we did right here. But we could also hold down the modifier control on the PC, command on the Mac to hand scroll and horizontal zoom at the same time. Hold on that modifier, go up here, drag left to right, it scrolls, but if we move up and down, it zooms in and out like this. So we get two options at the same time. Move left and right to scroll, up and down to zoom horizontally. But we could change that to add in horizontal zoom to this option instead, or in addition. Just double click, go to hand scroll, horizontal zoom, and just add horizontal zoom right here. And now by default, without holding down that modifier, we can get the same behavior, which is my preference. We just go up here, move left and right to scroll and up and down to zoom in and out horizontally. But again, the default is just to hand scroll. Now we could also do this in the ruler. If we change this to the ruler context, it doesn't show up here by default, but we could still add it in this context if you want. Let's choose this one, go to hand scroll, horizontal zoom, and choose our options right here. Let's just hand scroll. And now we can put our cursor above the arrangement window, but below the project marker region lane to our ruler. Hold down that modifier and drag it left and right to scroll through our project. So it doesn't show up there by default, but we can still add it in that context. But let's go back to this context right here. Again, the default is to just hand scroll, but we could add the other option right here. But we could also add move edit cursor as well. Let's add this one. Now it's going to hand scroll, but also move the edit cursor at the same time. So if we move up here, we could drag left and right, but every time we click in a section, it moves the edit cursor as well. So we could do two things at once, move the edit cursor and also hand scroll, moving left and right. And we could do all three things at the same time if we want. Just choose horizontal zoom as well. They all show up. We can drag left and right 
and it moves the edit cursor and also scrolls through our project. And we can move up and down to horizontally zoom in and out of our project. So we can do three things at once if you want. But well, my personal preference is to leave this option off, but leave these two on. So at all times, we can grab up here to scroll left and right, but go up and down to zoom in and out, closer and further away. And this will also work for MIDI. If I go down here to my MIDI item and double click it, it opens up the MIDI editor. We can put our cursor up here, notice the cursor changes to a hand tool. And again, we could drag left and right to scroll through our project. But by default, it doesn't move up and down to horizontally zoom. If you want to do that, we could hold down control on the PC, command on the Mac to get that behavior. Go up and down to zoom in and out, left and right to scroll through the project. And we could see that in here. Under MIDI marker region lanes, we could hand scroll by default or hand scroll and horizontally zoom if we hold down control on the PC, command on the Mac. But again, we could change it right here, which is my preference to do both by default. So I could drag left and right to hand scroll or up and down to zoom in and out horizontally. Now I should also mention in any of the contexts where hand scroll shows up, like this one, we also have a checkbox down here to reverse the horizontal zoom when hand scrolling. When this is unchecked and we choose hand scroll in here, we could hand scroll left and right, but if we pull down, it zooms out. And if we pull it up, it zooms in. If we want the reverse behavior, we can just hit this checkbox. And now pulling it down, zooms in. And moving it up, zooms out. Left to right still works the same, but it now zooms in when we go down and zooms out when we go up. But with this unchecked, it does the opposite. Going down, zooms out, and going up, zooms in. So you can just choose whichever behavior you want, as this checkbox will show up in any context where hand scroll shows up. It's off by default, but if you want this, just check it right here. So that's pretty much it. That's the hand scroll and horizontal zoom in Reaper. I hope you learned something, hope you can use it, and I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bingo, boys, let's go.